Says Rabbeinu Avram, Ve'ikir abi tochenu chizuk ho amunu ki Hashem yis'alu hu abayu v'amefarnes. We're going to see how Rabbeinu Avram takes a different path to what Rabbeinu Bechai and Chavis Avavos did, but not in a different, not telling us there's a different path to be talking, but rather the way he explains it is a little bit different. Because of course, the Rabbeinu Bachia was very expansive in describing the different steps and how a person reaches a Muna and believing in Hashem, that Hashem does everything, and that there's no other power but HaKadosh Baruch and so forth. And here we see the Rabbeinu Avram immediately jumps in to list all these things. As he says, Bitochen is based on Chizuk HaMunah believing that Hashem is the creator and Hashem is the one who gives panos. Hashem is the one that gives life and Hashem takes it. Hashem makes people sick and Hashem heals them. Hashem makes people rich and Hashem makes people poor. Everything in this world, the big things, the small things, everything comes from HaKadosh Baruch Hu. And only He does it. He's the one that makes the Gezer they should happen and he's the one who makes it happen. In other words, everything that we saw in the Rechav is that he is the one that sends the message that it should happen. He sends the intermediaries and he makes it all happen. The one thing that the, the, the Rabbi Avram tells us there is one thing in this world that a person has the ability to have Bechir in this world, which of course he discusses at length in other program. But everything in this world happens with a direct gezerim aburiz barach shemoy, as the pasuk says, "Nama batoyrim misom pela adam who gave a person the ability to speak, or miyosim inim echir shepkeach eval or noichi Hashem who made a person to give a person the ability to see, to hear." Vo'ed nema v'zacharitas Hashem alekeach kan noiz nuchakoyich lasas choyel Hashem is the one who gives you energy to do anything in this world, and the pasuk says, "Ru ato ki ani ani hu ve'ein alehim imodi ani omis v'achayim machatzim ani epem yadim atzla." I'm the one. That makes people sick. I'm the one that heals. The Yaakov Amai, Yaakov said, "Ale kima roy oisimoy diadim The the Hashem, my Creator, who is my Shepherd from when I was created until this day, alluding to what the Chayv Savavas told us, believing that Hashem was there from before we were created till our end. The Chana Amr Chana said, "Hashem may misamechay and moyrit shoel vayal." Hashem is the one that's there forever and ever. Hashem moyrit shamasha. Hashem is the one that makes people poor, makes people rich. Mashpulaf meroyim elif. Hashem brings sickness and brings health. And of course, Rabbi Avram tells us the psukim that the Maram is to be talking to Amun and Hakadosh Baruch Hu and his ability and doing everything. That the reality is that everything comes from him. There are many psukim on this. And Maram also says the Rabbi Avram. Therefore, if a person has clear Clear emunah that Hakadosh Baruch Hu is the creator of everything in this world, and Hashem is the cause, and Hashem is the goyrim, and Hashem is the intimate, Hashem is everything. And that every intermediary in this world can only do and is bound by the will of Hakadosh Baruch Hu. And they can only do what Hakadosh Baruch Hu wants them to do. Therefore, he'll get betachin, and of course we. See here an incredible thing how the Rabbeinu Avram is working a Muna into Betochen. In other words, we know that a Muna and Betochen are two things. A Muna and Hashem, I know that Hashem created the world, and a Yichud Hashem, that Hashem is one and there's no other creator. Betochen is trusting and putting my trust in HaKadosh Baruch Hu, that He and only He does everything. And the, every intermediary is only coming through Him. But what Rabbeinu Avram is, Avram is doing is something that we see how we correlate the Rambam, his father, with Rabbeinu Avram. And if for example, we see that the Rambam, when we look a little bit, if we look for Tachlis Abri and the Rambam, we see the idea of Yediyas Hashem, of knowing that HaKadosh Baruch Hu exists. But when we look at the works of Rabbein Avram, we see the idea more of a person working on their midas and connecting with HaKadosh Baruch Hu. But of course, if we understand it a little deeper, we see that they work together. When a person has Yediyas Hashem, therefore he works on his midas toivus, and therefore he's closer to Hashem. And we see Rabbein Avram doing this with Betachen also. First, the person has to have a but when a person has real emunah and he works that in an understanding that everything that happens in this world is from HaKadosh Baruch Hu, literally the word you use, you can have a wonderful day.